once again for America's favorite environmentally friendly game show, Wheel of Trash, where we see how much our contestants know about the effects plastic bags have on our environment. So let's welcome our host, Jesse, to the show. Welcome everyone to Wheel of Trash. Now let's get started. How many grocery bags do you use yearly in the USA? Liana? I would guess about 100 million. Aww, Aww, that's incorrect. Let's go to Nikita for the correct answer. There are really 100 billion bags used. Just do the math. One plastic bag per day, multiply that by 365 days in a year, and then by 300 million people in the United States. That's a lot of bags. In fact, Benton and Franklin County residents alone use nearly 41 million bags a year using the same math equation. Wow, thanks Nikita. Let's go on to our next question. What's the biggest problem with people not bringing reusable bags? Bella, forgetting them? That's correct. Most people have reusable bags, but in a survey we conducted with over 300 people, we found they answered that they forget reusable bags more than anything else. Nikita, any helpful tips on how to remember? I'm glad you asked. Include bag on your shopping list or add the reminder to your phone calendar. Put your keys or coupons into a bag. Ask your family members to remind you or put bags into the trunk or back seat so they're there with you wherever you go. Thanks, those are some great tips. Let's move on to the next question. Do all plastic bags biodegrade? I know this answer. The manager at the local supermarket told me that some bags photodegrade, so the answer is no. Hmm, Nikita, did you get that right? She's correct. And these break down into smaller and smaller toxic bits, contaminating the environment, killing plants and animals. Next question. How many dollars per ton does it take to recycle plastic bags? $400. No, sorry, but it looks like Bella may know this answer. Bella? As a matter of fact, I do. The manager at the local recycling company told me that the real number can be up to $4,000 per ton. That's right. Reducing the cost of recycling plastic bags could help us save the environment. Plastic bags are a very big problem since they increase our carbon footprint, which is not good for our Earth. And incinerators give out a lot of carbon dioxide. That's why parts of China does not have very clean oxygen. Okay, next question. Name four possible solutions to the plastic bag problem that have already been tried. I know, banning plastic bags completely, plastic bag free days, offering a discount for using reusable bags, or making these wonderful items of clothing. Correct! So, as a follow-up question, is banning plastic bags entirely the best idea? No, I've read an article that said when they tried to ban plastic bags in Texas, people started throwing away reusable plastic bags instead. Wow, that could really affect the environment. You are both right. So what is the real answer to this plastic bag problem? Building public awareness, providing education, and encouraging behavior change, such as increasing the use of reusable bags or recycling at stores can really change the mind of people using plastic bags. And encouraging public leaders and businesses to be part of the solution. For example, many grocery stores here in Richland accept used plastic bags and recycle them properly. This keeps those bags out of our landfills, parks, and rivers. You're both correct. Let's go to Nikita for any last thoughts. Awareness and behavior starts one person, one bag at a time. Since the start of our game show, roughly four minutes, over 900,000 plastic bags have been used throughout the world. Just think how easy it would be to reduce that number. Thanks, Nikita, and thanks to our contestants for playing, and thanks to you for watching Wheel of Trash. Sources of information for Wheel of Trash are interviews with the managers at the recycling company and local supermarkets, an online poll serving 350 people with 10 questions, and internet articles. Wheel of Trash is brought to you by the Munchkin Mechanics.